Okay, so we're here at the 127th, I think it's the one, yeah, 127th AES convention. Um, we're here at the Korg, uh, the Korg booth, and I'm here uh, checking out their new product called the Waves Drum. And um, I have the rep from Korg right here, his name is Rich, he's going to tell us a little bit about it. Hey guys, uh, as you said, I'm going to tell you a little bit about the Wave Drum, so let's just get started. So it's definitely a drum. You can tell just by looking at it, it has a real drum head. You can tune it, you can replace it, and it'll change the way the wave drum reacts. So you can see I'm hitting it with sticks. I'm not playing any samples. This is a snare model. Now, that being said, I don't have to use sticks. So nice. because it's not playing samples, it's actually taking a small sample of my performance, the actual playing on the head, and translating that into the driving force behind a modeling synth. So beyond the sticks and brushes, it's getting some mallets, and I'll call it a timpani model. Wow. You can hear I have a different sound on the rim. An orchestral crash and uh, the timpani on the head. Tune it by pressing a little harder. Now, in addition to being able to play it with sticks and mallets, you can also play it by hand. So that's a Doombeck model, and I could go in and decide I want it to be made of metal or wood, and how thick is it, how resonant is the shell. So all of that is customizable. So, great toggle model in there as well. And there are even some loops you can play along with. So, it's for custom loops, and we'll jam along with something here. So, it's a lot of fun to play, and uh, unlike the original, it's not going to be $2,700. So, the Wave Drum has been reborn, and look for it at the end of December, beginning of January. Thanks for watching. All right, we got it. Wave Drum, right here.